I'm Special Agent Will Trent. You're gonna be okay. Agent Dawson, how are we doing down there? Almost there. I see the detonator. I just need to ask a few questions. Right now? I saw a billboard right by where I was staying, and I asked the driver, you know, would you mind pulling over and, uh, and taking a photo for me? He had no idea why. And then we get out of the car, and I'm like, check it out. Like, that doesn't happen all the time. And so the little boy in me gets very excited. It's all good, baby. No one's going to mess with your choo-choos. <laughs> She's living her best life, you know? We need to figure out how to get in that, like, sort of life track. She's crushed it, you know? She, uh, it was lovely to see that she remembered me from season one. She sort of came right up to me, which was really nice, and she's wonderful. I mean, you know, she just had, you know, we fly her in, she does her scenes, and she goes right back. She's got the life, I'm telling you. That's why I call the killer. Hey, when's the last time you were in a swimming pool? I'm in the middle of the case. Chicken. This is going to take all night, ladies. He's wearing the French cuffs. Luckily, we shoot primarily both seasons in the winter. So it's something you want to have those layers. When we shot the pilot, it was summer. It was brutal. But, you know, I think for me, it was more sort of what it meant. That three-piece suit, his armor, um, those layers that he uses to protect himself and present himself in a certain way so his secrets aren't revealed. But at the same time, I feel like, you know, you can stuff all your issues under the rug and it'll get lumpy. And at some point you might step on some of those issues and it'll sort of come out. Agent Dawson, I would very much like to take you to dinner, then defuse another bomb and then have sexual intercourse, if that's all right. 